Today I'm going to try to figure out which one of these bottles holds ice the longest. Now I am sponsored by the coldest water bottle, and I think the bottle they sent me this year was defective. Nah, I'm just joking around, but if you have that issue, they do make wide mouth bottles too, so you can put whole chunks of ice inside the bottle without breaking it up first. Once I finished putting as much ice as possible into all the bottles, I secured their lids and began the experiment. The starting time was 10.44, and in one hour I checked it at 11.44, and you can see all of them on the outside are reading right around 75 degrees, except for that purple one which is reading much colder, which could be evidence that the vacuum insulation on that one was somehow damaged, and it will probably be the first one to run out of ice. By the end of the first hour, all the water bottles were performing so well, I decided to move them outside where it was 102 degrees today to really put them to the test. I left them outside all night long, and then I brought them back in the next morning at roughly 7 a.m. Amazingly, that purple one I believe to be damaged was the only one that completely ran out of ice. Here's the problem, I'm out of time, so I guess this was just an elimination round. The purple bottle is out, and I will be doing this again to see how the rest of the bottles stack up.